This video will be a step-by-step -step guide on how to do your first trades using Uniswap on Optimism. I do recommend that you watch the whole video until the end and you follow along because maybe you get lucky and you earn a few thousand dollars in airdrops because Optimistic Ethereum doesn't have a governance token yet, but maybe in the future. So who knows, you might get lucky. I'm really excited about this layer to scaling solutions. This is a very historic moment for Ethereum and who knows, maybe this can make the Uni token, the Uniswap governance token 100x. All about this in this video. My name is Kieran and you're watching The Decentralized Lifestyle where I teach you how to invest like smart money so that you can retire early. So if you're new to the channel, I do highly recommend that you hit that subscribe button as well as the bell notification icon so that you get my videos sent to your inbox right away when I upload them. And you don't want to miss this time sensitive content. So first of all, if you haven't heard of layer two scaling solutions and you haven't heard of optimism and you're wondering, yeah, what, what all the fuss is about? Well, the problem with Ethereum layer one, that's the Ethereum that most people are familiar with is that to use decentralized applications, you have to pay massive amounts of gas fees. That means you might pay $10, $20, or even $100 or $200 if the network is congested. And even if you're paying such high amounts in gas fees, you will still have to wait quite a long time because the network is congested and all the, everyone is wanting to transact at the same time and it makes all the transactions super slow. So this is a massive problem. This is a scalability problem that many companies have been trying to solve. Now, Optimism is one of these solutions. It's like a blockchain on top of Ethereum. And it's the new scalability stack for Ethereum. Now, there are other ones like Arbitrum, but this video will be about Optimism. So you can imagine it as a blockchain on top of Ethereum that compresses like a zip folder all of the transactions and makes it a lot faster and a lot cheaper. So this is great. This is really important because it means that you can do some trades at super low prices and also the trades go through nearly instantaneously. How fast you might be wondering? Well, here's an example using uh, the Uniswap trade version 3. A fee and optimism could be around 16 cents. I've seen from my examples that these trades were actually a little bit higher than that but um, optimally it would be around 10x cheaper doing a trade on optimism layer 2 than doing it on um, uniswap version 3 running on the ethereum layer 1 so the, the expense of ethereum so that's one of the main reasons that why so many people are excited about layer two scaling solutions on Ethereum. Now, before I continue with the step-by-step -step tutorial, I do highly recommend that you follow along if you've already got a MetaMask wallet and maybe send a few dollars to the Optimism Bridge and do one or two swaps. The reason for that is because over the last year, I actually made more than $50,000 in airdrops alone. Meaning I actually was one of the first users of different decentralized application platforms and those platforms actually rewarded um, pioneers of those platforms with a governance token. So Uniswap was one example, one inch exchange was one example. And of all the tokens that I received, I got around $50,000. One video talking only about that is coming out soon. So do make sure that you subscribe. Now, Optimism doesn't have a token yet. Now, they haven't said if they will be releasing a token or will not. So they might actually surprise release a token sometime in the next three months, six months, nine months. Who knows? And who would be the best candidates to actually airdrop the tokens? Well, those that have used decentralized applications are running on Optimism. That's why I highly recommend do a few trades use Uniswap and use also other decentralized applications that will be launching soon on Optimism. You might know, maybe maybe in a few months, you might get an airdrop that's worth thousands of dollars. All right, so let's start with the step-by-step -step guide. I'm really excited about that. And if you're excited about that, comment down below and tell me if you've already done one of these uh, swaps, if you've completed this task successfully. So the first thing that you want to do is add the optimistic chain onto your metamask wallet for that you go to chainlist.org you look for optimistic and then what you'll have to do you get all of these options here most of them are test nets but then you just look for the optimistic ethereum and then you click on connect wallet and then when metamask opens up you can just click on approve 
and then you can click on switch to network. This will actually change your MetaMask to the optimistic Ethereum network. If you want to do trades on Uniswap using the Ethereum layer one, you will have to change this to um, Ethereum. But if you want to use Uniswap and do trades on optimistic Ethereum, you're going to have to switch this to uh, optimistic Ethereum. Now, the next thing that you have to do is since optimism is actually like a, a, another island close to Ethereum, it's this blockchain above Ethereum, you're going to have to use a bridge in order to put funds from e from ethereum onto the optimism blockchain and there's one thing that i have to uh, mention here is that since optimism is still a bit of a beta um, software is still quite centralized uh, the admin keys are still held by um, optimism developers another thing is if you want to actually move funds from optimism onto ethereum there's a seven day delay um, this is unfortunate um, but it's something that's pretty common with uh, most layer two solutions. But that, with that uh, out of the way, let's actually deposit some funds onto Optimism. And you will do that using gateway.optimism.io. Uh, go to this website, make sure you've got MetaMask installed and everything like that. Click on connect. You can also use some other uh, apps such as Wallet Connect, which is available in the Trust Wallet, and you can use the Coinbase Wallet. But this tutorial will be using MetaMask. Once you um, connect it, you get the MetaMask um, pop up window which will open. You just click on Next and then you click on Connect to Account. Now, what you want to do now is actually you want to, on the top right hand side, you want to actually um, switch to Ethereum mainnet because you're moving funds first from Ethereum onto optimism that means on ethereum you will have to confirm the transactions so make sure you're here switch to the ethereum mainnet on the deposit tab then you will actually input the amount of ETH you want to move from ethereum onto optimism you can, i'm just moving 0.2 ETH onto optimism i click on deposit and then i'll get this pop-up window approve the deposit that's what i have to do so i click on deposit and the metamask window opens up i confirm these transactions and then i will get this information window that says deposit en route to optimistic ethereum this will take a few minutes to actually confirm when it's confirmed um you will see it and what you can also see is when you click on withdraw you will see the funds that you've got on optimistic ethereum there's also another way that you can see it, and that is by going to Optimistic Etherscan. It's basically the Optimism version of Etherscan. You go to Optimistic.Etherscan, and you can get all the information of your wallet. Now, the interesting thing is that if you're using Optimistic Ethereum or you're using Ethereum, your wallet address will stay the same as long as you're using the same private keys. And that, that's a pretty cool thing. So you paste in your um, Optimistic Ethereum address, and then here you under balance you will actually see the amount of ETH you've got and if you've got other tokens some ESC20 tokens you will see this under this drop down so if you've got some DAI or USDC or Shiba Inu or whatever you will see those under the ESC20 tokens and this is very handy to see if your transactions actually went through. Now let's actually start with doing one of a swap on Uniswap. If you go to app.uniswap.org make sure here under the drop down you've got optimism selected the other thing that you're going to have to do is make sure that your wallet is showing the optimistic ethereum chain we looked at that before how to switch to optimistic ethereum make sure that metamask is showing uh, optimistic ethereum otherwise this won't work you will get a notification saying you're on the wrong chain or here it will just show ethereum instead of optimism now let's actually swap some eth for die so i'm going to swap 0.1 eth for 174 die which is more or less 174 dollars i click on swap then i'll get this pop-up window which gives me all the information such as liquidity provider fee this is the fee i have to prov like pay to those people that are providing liquidity for my swaps um price impact here is zero percent this is an important one to look at especially with like lower uh, gems or shit coins um, if there's not a lot of liquidity here you might see a price impact of one percent two percent five percent or even more and what is also really important is looking at the minimum received that's the amount that you will actually receive at least 
for this transaction and the slippage tolerance is one percent which actually i could have made lower so i click on confirm swap i'm going to have to confirm this in my metamask it's basically the same thing as when you're doing a uniswap trade um nothing changes the only thing that changes is the chain that you're doing it on just click on confirm and it actually goes through really fast and i receive my 174 dot to die more than the minimum that was stated then what i can do is actually look on optimistic scan i can actually look at the trade that went through i get all the information about where the the the, the, the transactions went through so the transaction fee is a little bit more than those 16 cents that was stated on the optimistic ethereum website so 42 cents is a little bit more but still a massive improvement to uniswap trades that you would normally do on ethereum layer one where you pay like ten dollars twenty dollars and so on or even more when the network was congested so that was it for this video pretty exciting thing being able to do some uniswap trades at the lake in sweden in the middle of nowhere where you have to have an internet connection to be able to do that but pretty awesome being able to live this decentralized lifestyle so i'll catch you in the next video leave a like if you like this type of content and i'll catch you in the next one have a good one Bye bye